34 yards pretty much left of the center line. And so one thing to pay attention to is where's the ball there was one started. Day that I would pray for you. I'd go and what is up everybody? Daniel back. We are inside. It is November. Back to winter golf where we have to use a simulator to get better. So I wanted to talk today about how to improve your game throughout the winter in a simulator. Um, I'm excited this year because I actually have my projector up with my GC quad. And so it feels a little more realistic when you're hitting inside and you can look forward and just watch the ball fly as opposed to looking at a different screen. So if you can get a projector in your garage, wherever it is, so much better. It, the quality makes everything better, uh, especially when you're inside for five, six months. Um, but what, we, what I wanted to talk today about is how to utilize your indoor setup uh, to make the most out of your winter practice. So one of the things uh, that I want to talk about is making sure that you're not underestimating or overestimating how far right or left you're hitting the ball to make it very realistic. So sometimes when you're hitting in a simulator, you might not know how far right or left the ball is actually going. So I want you to pay attention to the offline number. Um, some have uh, spin numbers to the left or right. Uh, I have a spin axis number that's showing me how much that ball is going to be curving. Um, so that is one area I want you to pay attention to. So let me hit a shot here and I'll, I'll hit a hook or a draw. That way we can see how far offline it truly is versus the visual of what it looks like on the screen. Okay. So I hit a big hook and it is 30, 34 yards pretty much left of the center line. And so one thing to pay attention to is where's the ball starting relative to the center line. This one started just a little bit left of it. And then I don't know, you tell me, some people think that this doesn't look like a lot, some people think it looks like a lot, but in reality that's 34 yards left of center. So paying attention to how far offline it is is going to be huge when you're actually seeing if you're improving this winter. Um, if you potentially think on your screen that it looks like a nice draw or if you do like to play a little bit of a hook, but in reality, it's 34 yards offline. You might not getting, be getting the most accurate results. Um, so that's the one area I want you to pay attention to is left or right. Then for me, I measured this green that I have on the screen for foresight. So I measured the width of this green and the depth of this green. And that is the same size green as my 18th hole here at Lakeshore Country Club. And so now when I practice and I hit balls or I'm hitting chips or something, I kind of have an idea of how deep or left or right that green truly is. And so I set myself up at the yardage that I am relative to that pin Let's say I have my eight iron in my hand. I hit it about between 155 and 160. I'll put the pin at 155. And if I'm hitting the green, I know what representation it is based off the 18th green. Um, so paying attention to the graphics is going to help you and allow you to make the most out of your winter practice. So pay attention to those few things and have fun this winter. There was once a day that I would pray for you. I'd go and misbehave just so you know.